Hey, what's up everyone? It's Nelson here with Gadjax, and today I'm going to be showing you how to speed up the stock touch whiz launcher on your Galaxy Note 3. So for this guide, you'll need to be rooted and you'll also need to have a file manager with root permissions on your Galaxy Note 3. I'll be using root browser. You'll also need to download the modded launcher. So there will be two options. You can download fast launcher or insane fast launcher. Uh, for this guide, I'll be using insane fast launcher. So once you've downloaded the fast launcher, which will download as sec launcher 4.apk, you'll need to go into root browser, go to SD card and go down to download. Here you'll find the sec launcher 4.apk. And here it is. So now hold down on it and copy it. Now we're gonna go all the way back. So now this time we're gonna go into system. So go into system, scroll down to priv app and go all the way down until you find the stock sec launcher 4.apk and its odex file. If you don't have the odex file, don't worry about it. So before we paste the new sec launcher 4.apk, you're gonna need to disable these. So do that by holding down, going to rename and adding .bak to the end of it. You're gonna do the same thing to the odex file if you have that. And now you're gonna paste the new sec launcher. And here it is. So the last thing you wanna do is hold down on it, go to permissions and set it so that it's like this, 0644. Then you press okay. And the next thing you wanna do is just restart your device. All right, so now we're booted back up and I'm gonna show you guys how much faster the TouchWiz launcher is. If I scroll through, you can see that it's very fast. The transitions have been sped up. If I open an application, it opens up instantly. You can tell that it's very fast. For some people, the insane fast launcher might be a little too fast, so you can use the fast launcher. According to the developer, this also improves RAM and improves battery life on your device. So let us know in the comments if you guys see any improvements. But for sure, you can tell that it is much faster than the stock TouchWiz launcher. To go back to the stock launcher, you'll need to go into root browser and delete the new sec launcher 4.apk file and take off the .bak from the other two files uh, if you have the odex file and then reboot your device. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and check out the full tutorial over at Gadgehex. All right, thanks, guys.